Sounds good. You have a great day. Employees at Moe's Smoke Shop in Brooklyn Park are proud of their spotless record. When uh, the cops or the FDA send somebody under 18, that's us passing. For six years, they've passed all of their tobacco compliance checks, making sure they ID anyone who looks young. You know, we don't sit here and sell the under 18 because we don't us, we don't even want kids to start smoking, you know. As a store in a city that still allows tobacco sales to anyone older than 18, employees say they're waiting for a cue from the federal government to change the legal age. Most stores are not going to sit here and call the FDA, so they're, they're expecting somebody either to stop by or a letter to come in that tells them this is you got to do this now. The FDA says the age change is happening now, but doesn't explain enforcement. Regardless, Clearway, Minnesota spokesperson Laura Smith says the change in federal policy is a victory for those fighting to reduce tobacco use. So we really hope this will be the first step of many to help reverse that epidemic. Smith says their next step is to get Minnesota to pass its own Tobacco 21 legislation no matter what happens at the federal level. So the state can and can pass a, um, an even earlier implementation date. Um, we can make sure all our laws are updated and, and clean and make sure that uh, we have resources to ensure that all retailers across the state are complying with the Tobacco 21 age and making the most of that. In Brooklyn Park, Sharon Yu, Carol 11 News.